He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. Do not trust Adler. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Mm, see, we were one of his associates. And they planted that saying that... The plane leaves traps on his stopping in Duba. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump the bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. Oh, wow. Wow. We found you. That's why he said, scan the uh, perimeter to see if there's any survivors. Oh, what he's like, yes. Is it like... The CIA reinvented you. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The My CIA's God. MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. Holy crap, how would you feel, right? That's all fake. We were never there. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Holy moly. Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Oh, no. We've got, Come a, job. On, We've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. Got a job to do. Got a job to do. Bioshock. Trigger phrase kept you in line. It didn't get us everything we needed. With, uh, would you kindly? Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now. What we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me. It's not about you. It's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the Green Black Arsenal, we will detonate them all for the safety of Solovets. Oh my god. I'm about to give up Perseus. This is your chance to divide him. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. Solovetsky. Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Wow, they totally transformed him into one of them. 
That's crazy. That's a crazy story. I, yo, props to whoever wrote this story. That's insane. I like it. I like it a lot. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. That David Hasselhoff looking dude. Task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. This cut scenes again. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Some of us have crossed the line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. Come on. They don't know us. As for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. That ends now. So they did say if you only killed Perseus in the jungle like you're supposed to. I wonder who they're talking about or what scenario. Okay, so we're like the reverse uh, Mason here. Coming up on your right. Belikov really came through in the Soviet armor. Not done, you caught up, Woods. No way I'm missing this. Motherfuckers are going to pay for Ice and Lazar. Look at your chance. Solovetsk is two clicks out. All units. Starfish inbound, 100 knots. And that baby hits will have 12 minutes past before the radio towers come back online. I wonder if there's a a story where we're not. Um, I wonder if there's a storyline where we're not actually uh, brainwashed by this guy here. Fuck me, that loses the fillings. Oh my god, what was that? Cinematic ending, right? How am I supposed to get the cover? Push up, push up, go, go, go! I mean, he could still like detonate it now, right? Straight ahead. RPG. Oh, okay. This isn't cold anymore. This is a hot war. You guys don't know why they called it a cold war. It's because there weren't any real conflicts. It was all through proxy wars and such, if I'm not mistaken. Like, it wasn't like the US invaded the Russians or the Russians invaded the United States. The more you know. Grenade, 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 grenade. Tell 
Contact. Whereabouts? That one's down. I don't want to run into some shotgun dudes. There you go. Holy moly. We got five minutes before all of Europe goes to Pick up the base. Yeah, this is intense. The power's coming back on. Oh, that was what it was Man, for. Woods, we're running out of time. I gotta tell Hudson to launch. That's a big gamble if that gun ain't cleared. Watch it. Heavy MG on the ridge. Woo, baby. We gotta keep moving. Oh no. Grenade. Hudson, start your bombing run. Yes, I'm running. Holy crap, bro. Holy moly, holy moly. Oh my god. No, Adler. I failed because Adler ran into my grenade. That was so stupid. I didn't see that many guns, so I guess it was a blessing in disguise. Where do I plant? Ah, oh, the other side, seriously. Come on. Time. Bell's gonna make the ultimate sacrifice. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank Please God. no lag. Please no and lag. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. Hmm. I didn't mean to keep going here, but we're on a roll. Them. Those towers are history. What's your situation down there? Come in. Woods, have you found them yet? Over here! Give me a hit! I wonder if Woods knows that we're uh, actually an agent. Take my hand, Bell. And he's gonna shoot us. We did it. This is a message to Perseus. And those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Oh, that was that it? Was that? Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah. After capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East. And with our resources behind him, he should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. Oh, I think it's like a recap of all the decisions we made. 
What about Anton Volkov? Volkov has become a prime source of information since his capture. After interrogating him, MI6 quickly established a series of listening posts in East Berlin. They've already intercepted messages from the KGB to assets throughout the city. We're poking holes in the Iron Curtain. Hmm. How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Azalea's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to his family and his caskets in transit to Tel Aviv. As you know, Helen Park returned to London. She'll continue to recover from her injuries there. Afterwards, MI6 plans to give her a task force dedicated to finding Perseus. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovetsky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. Not anymore. We took down that son of a bitch Aldrich, as well as his key assets here in the States. It'll take Perseus a while to recover from this one. What about Europe? Not only did we stop a nuclear attack, we managed to take out Major Vadim Rudnik. That should be a significant blow to Perseus's European network. We also flushed all of Rudnik's key assets down the shitter. Maybe someday Perseus can join him. Hudson, you're the Shakespeare of Langley. And Bell. Arctic air. This is it, guys. I think this is the ending. There's the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision of your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's oh my god, I think he's gonna kill me. One more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. Oh! What? What? What a dark ending. Oh, okay. Alright, that was one of the endings. I think I would try and do another ending. That was... Oof. Tricky. Tricky. There's a lot of uh, endings to go through, I guess. My goodness. Okay. Well, after all that, so we ba they basically just used us, and then they killed us after. So that was the ending. Uh, I think I'll be playing it again because I want to see the other endings. Hello guys, welcome again. You just saw uh, the good ending, I think, if you can call it that. Um, but yeah, here we are again, back a few days after. And we're going to try and do the bad ending. <laughs> Let's go see what happens. <laughs> I just got a haircut, as you guys can notice, a couple days ago. Why do I look like Kim Jong something? Why do I look so weird? Oh, it looks better without the headphones, trust me. <laughs> He's coming too. Here we go. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? Oh man, they betrayed me. What you're going through now is nothing compared to... Uh, what did you do? We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kadavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Hmm. Yeah, we've seen this, so we're uh, moving on to the next dialogue part. See, this is like the, the bad ending. 
but at the same time, it's like who we really are. You know, the, the bad ending is we're not. Get yeah, you know what I mean. Mind. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on, you're still one of us. Ooh, Adler is marked red now. Set up ambush at Duga. Oh, ho, ho. Adler. Right. Anything over here? Nothing. Yeah. Ooh, there's a video game. Can't go do that. All right, all right. We'll leave within the hour. We'll set up the ambush at Duga. We won't let the president oh no, we're gonna betray all our friends. Our fake friends. The guys who brainwashed us and made us into a CIA Five experiment. Five years ago, NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine. The Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal they want. Like detonation codes to every green light nuke in Europe. Where exactly is this thing? About 60 miles north of Kiev. Between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl. It's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. We'll have to drop you in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Bell came through for us in the nick of time. I never doubted it. Wait, is this uh, after or before the Chernobyl uh, nuclear power plant incident? But all right, let's see. Adler, still seeing no activity from our side. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right, everyone converge on the gate. Here we go. Oh, I have a bad feeling. It's gonna be so bad. We're gonna kill all our friends. <clears throat> you sure you're not forgetting something, Bill? There's nothing here. This can't be the right place. We didn't see anything on our side either. It's him. Fucking lied to us. Oh, Woods is mad. True, Bell. <clears throat> you pull us out to the middle of nowhere, Russia, so Perseus can detonate those nukes. Oh. Oh, what the heck? That's gonna hurt us. Look at that, Perseus. On your feet, comrade. Ready for a little retribution? Yeah, made us. Oh my God, we're gonna kill. Oh, I wanna, I wanna melee park. I wanna melee all these people, actually. Oh no! And Mason! Oh my goodness. And finish Adler off. Crazy. It seems like we heard him too. The cat becomes the mouse. Oof. 
Oh no. <coughs> Glad to see you still care. Mind giving me a light? Oh, you wanna fight? Don't you know I'm good at tapping X? You don't even know how good I am at tapping X. I've done this in so. Okay, he's dead. Hey, Adler. Adler. Well, that's such a bad ending, isn't it? We killed all those guys. Oh, man, that's rough. You remember my face, don't you? Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. Ugh, here we go. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold. But that chapter is closed now. We begin the next one together. You did well. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. <laughs> As if Perseus all right. could ever be an individual. Oh, Perseus is a group. So American. Ah. We'll need a new home now. The Central Committee will be more surprised than the CIA. Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Hmm. Yet, for humanity, their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come, there is still much to be done. Holy moly, yeah, Perseus is, uh, everyone. My so bad. God. How many green light nukes did he detonate? All of them, Mr. President. Does anyone know the bombs were ours? Materials related to Operation Greenlight were anonymously released an hour ago, presumably by Perseus. Calls are beginning to come in from across the globe. That son of a bitch. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. We will watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire of the United States collapse under its own weight. A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. And if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, then they too will be replaced. All right. Kasim Javadi. He fell into the hands of your former CIA Oh, it's like another side of it. Kasim is too soft. I will need you to personally supervise his erasure. As with Kasim, the CIA is now holding Anton Volkov. If you can locate him, bring him back to us. If they have broken him, he must be eliminated. You say that Eliezer Azule perished in Cuba. We will not miss that one. His interference with our Middle East assets will be a distraction no more. As for the rest, it was a pleasure eliminating them by your side. Oh. 
Wait, Sims is alive, right? Even though we have prevailed, the CIA has significantly wounded our foundation inside the U.S. Robert Aldrich has been killed, and our network there has collapsed. It could take us years to regain the footing we have lost. The death of Major Vadim Rudnik is a terrible loss for post-nuclear Europe. He was to help Shepard in the Soviet-aligned future. Hopefully, we can still move forward without his presence there. The CIA also managed to eliminate all three of Rudnik's key assets. We have no one else to help fill the void. Inserting new agents into such influential positions will take years. But have no doubt, these are but temporary losses. We are just getting started, my friend. Okay, guys, there you have it. Both endings, the good and the bad. And uh, definitely a very dark one, this ending, uh, the bad one. I do hope that you guys have enjoyed the whole series. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that I will see you guys in another video uh, sometime soon, hopefully. Until then, stay safe, stay healthy, and yeah, bye-bye.